in this cypress tutorial we are going to see how to scroll up how to scroll down in the cypress web automation testing let's look at the manual scenario first so here i will go to the youtube.com and here i'm searching for the javascript by testers talk so here i will get the first playlist so here i will go to the javascript by tester stock playlist so let's wait for few seconds so it is got loaded that's it so here we will scroll down till end of the playlist and here we will click on the last second video that is a javascript 31 inheritance with examples so we will see how to scroll down and how to click on the this particular link by using the cypress now i will navigate to the vs code and here i will simply delete all this stuff so just now i tried this scenario simply i will delete this js file as well so let's create a quickly one js file inside the e2e folder so here i'll say scroll down up dot cy dot js so that's it so inside this particular js file i will add the one simple test so here i'll copy paste the copy paste the old code and which has the skeleton of the test suit and test so let's add the suit name here so here i'll say scroll up down suit and in the similar way here i'll add the test name as scroll test so first we have to navigate to the this particular url let's copy the url and here i will add it inside the visit method that's it so once we navigate it to this particular url so let's wait for some time because it is a heavy loaded application it has many videos so that's the reason here i'm giving the weight as 5000 milliseconds that's it now we will identify this particular video by using the visible link text so simply i will copy the this particular text and i will go back here here i will use the cy dot contains method so inside the contains method i will add the text whatever we copied it from the web page and after that so here i'm saying scroll into view method so simply i'm calling to the method called scroll into view and then followed by that i'm calling another method called should so here i'm saying inside the single quote b dot visible so here i'm saying to this particular cypress command scroll into view until this particular text is found in the playlist so that's where i have added the should until this text is visible simply scroll in the playlist that's it once you found the video simply click on the that particular video that's it guys and then i at the end i'm calling the click method so that's it guys so we have written just three lines of code in the first line in the first line we are navigating to the playlist and here we are, we are waiting for the five seconds then here we are scrolling in the playlist once we got the video with the this particular title then we are simply clicking on that particular video that's it guys now i will go to the cypress test runner and here i will open the js file which is created just now and it has started the test execution and if you see here it is navigated to the playlist and after navigating to that particular url so it is waiting for some time and then finally it is clicking on this particular video which we have mentioned in the our test right and if you see the test status also our test is getting passed 
so here you can mention even another video title also say for example i want to click on the javascript full course overview so simply you can copy this text that's a visible text and put it inside the contains method so now this time let's try to click on the last video in the playlist and now i will come back to the cypress test runner and i will run the test so if you look at this one so it has clicked on the last video in the playlist right and if you see here so this is the last video javascript course overview and you can cross verify so this is the last video in the playlist so our test is working fine and if you see the test status so our test is getting passed so this is how you can scroll up or down in the cypress web automation testing